16-year-old skydiver in Oklahoma somehow survived a nearly half-mile fall after her parachute failed to open correctly. Officials say she fell 3,500 feet. 911, what can I help you with? Um, yes, we're skydiving at Pegasus Airports, and somebody just had an accident. Okay, we have Angela on the way. Is she okay? It's a girl. Is she okay? No, she's not. She's on the ground moaning. Wow. Doctors say she's recovering now from multiple fractures, plus a torn liver and a kidney. The trip, by the way, part of her Sweet 16 birthday present. Leah Gabriel is back on the Fox News deck. How do you fall half a mile and live to tell about it? Well, you know, Shep, Mackenzie Wethington's family says that she and her father spent six hours training earlier in the day. Uh, but when Mackenzie jumped, something went wrong. Now, her father says that he actually went first. And after he landed, he saw her falling. According to Mackenzie's sister, she spiraled the whole way down and couldn't reach up and pull the backup chute. Her vertebrae broke in half. Her pelvic bone completely split in half. She has more broken bones in her back. She has two broken ribs, her teeth. Now she says that her sister is now breathing on her own and talking on her own as well. She also claims that an instructor was supposed to jump after Mackenzie, but for some reason didn't, Shep. Wow, has the skydiving school said anything about that? Well, Mackenzie jumped with a company called Pegasus Air Sports Center, and we did reach out to their owner today. We have had no response. But in other interviews, he said that Mackenzie did something wrong, and he hasn't explained exactly what he means by that. Now, the family also says that they went to Oklahoma because the school allowed her to jump, even though she's not yet 18. And according to the website, Shep, they would have had to, the family would have had to sign this release, which acknowledges the risk of injury and even death, Shep. Mm. Leah Gabriel on the Fox News deck in New York. Leah, thanks a lot.